The crisis showed us how significant role technology may have in education and what role the technology and the digital competencies are playing at all levels of education. And not only in education, our readiness to keep contributing to the society and to stay connected, it all depended now on our digital know-how, infrastructure and also on our mindset. Some years ago, when we started talking more and more about the Internet of Things or data and analytics, I guess only the innovators were ready to really understand what these technologies would change in the study process or what, for what they would change for the schools or for the teachers or for the students and also for the parents, what they could benefit from these technologies. For everyone else, it was something waiting for us in the future, maybe. And today, after this massive and common experience, most of us probably understand how important the data is and how, for example, anal analytics technologies could support and help us to make smart decisions. To support, for example, teacher providing information about their students' progress and well-being or to decide what should be the next best step for every individual student or from the perspective of parents. Being a parent, I want to know how my kids are coping with the studies. Now, when they need to be more independent and they need to be more responsible for their learning. Are they on track with everything what is expected from them? One of the initiatives that help us to find out what are the change makers in the digital world that are influence, influencing also education is the Technology Trends Monitoring Project. Together with our stakeholders, with universities, schools, tech field experts, we are compiling the technology compass for the schools. I know that there are many other reports available, but what makes us different from the other reports is the fact that we have decided that this report has to tell a foresight directly to the teachers and to the school people. It is talking about the global technology trends from the perspective of education. So we are focusing mainly on two questions. First, how technologies will and can change the learning and teaching process and we are trying to find out the new possibilities, good practices that are used maybe already today or could be used in the future. And the second question is, what should we teach about these emerging technologies? So we are trying to find out and highlight the future competencies that we should teach to prepare our future citizens and that we should teach already on K-12 level. The first report was launched at the beginning of 2019 and the second came out at the beginning of 2020. Today we are focusing uh, on seven topics, the IoT, VR and AR, Big Data and Analytics, Artificial Intelligence, Privacy, Personalized Learning, Gamification and Game-Based Learning. This crisis made us even more confident that we need to keep looking towards to the future. The Compass uh, is one of the ways how we are trying to understand how we should teach the future and what we should teach to our future. To be ready when it's time. Kids study at different pace by using different means they have different interests and strengths. But in schools, we divide them into classes by age and teach them by the same plan in 45 minute sprints. This is the root cause of school failure, which is estimated to cost 1.4% of GDP in Estonia. Personalization is expected to have dramatic positive impact on school failure, plus can increase well-being outside of school as well. However, modern learning tools and materials have not been designed to support personalization. The main obstacle is lack of interoperability among tools and limited access to insights. This is why we initiated development of 
personalized learning path infrastructure. The infrastructure provides standards, data, and services to cost-effectively increase impact on personalization. Whether your strategy is differentiation, personalization, or individualization, Kitsa's infrastructure makes it easy to apply. Most importantly, it does not create any overhead to teachers and students. Data-driven services fueled by modern AI support evidence-based decision-making throughout the entire study process. More specifically, the infrastructure provides advanced insights for each individual student in almost real time. Predefined dashboards visualize learning analytics, which helps to understand students' learning behavior, how they learn, what motivates them, and what are their blockers. Teachers can effectively intervene when needed, not after, after catastrophic failures at national examinations or high-impact tests. The infrastructure is built of modules and can be easily extended. There are data harvesting modules which combine learning traces scattered around isolated applications into complete learning paths. There are also integrated data labeling modules which enrich learning paths with other study-related datasets, such that new analytical or machine learning models can be created and evaluated on the fly. The infrastructure facilitates academic research, innovation studies, and policy recommendations via navigation, via root cause analysis, simulations, and other problem-solving methods. Finally, the infrastructure is open for third-party models, agents, and solutions, which can all share the resources on the platform. Most importantly, data usage is transparent, respects privacy of data subjects, and complies to regulation in education. We see one key aspect of the future of education in an ecosystem of education technology providers. Together with Tallinn University and Startup Estonia, we have established a co-creation program bringing together Estonian educational institutions and companies to develop uh, education technology solutions. The aim of the program is to create high quality digital solutions, not just for Estonia, but for the global education market. Companies meet regularly with representatives of schools and kindergartens involving teachers and students in product development. This guarantees that companies create tools that are proven to be beneficial for the learning process as a whole.